everybody, welcome to Rimrose World of Autism. In this video, I wanted to give you um, a bit of an update about how everything is going. Um, it hasn't been going all that well uh, with me, actually. Um, I have been feeling very, very burned out from my uh, full time job. The job itself, uh, yeah, very stressful. In customer care, and um, so I'm uh, I'm really struggling with that a lot. The waking up at 5 a.m. in the morning, and uh, and then taking a cold shower because since uh, many weeks we don't have hot water in this building, um, and uh, we're actually taking legal steps to uh, to try to get uh, something done about that. So and that's been adding to it, to the extra stress and uh, everything is just pretty chaotic and yeah. So no, I can't really say that it's going all that uh, fantastic. I've been um, I think thinking a lot about it. I've been um, also uh, thinking about a solution. And next week I'm gonna start with evening shifts again. So that I can start at 3 in the afternoon and then work until 11 in the evening. So that I can avoid waking up at 5 a.m. in the mornings. And so that I can just take my time in the mornings and then get some more sleep. Try to recuperate a bit and uh, to uh, yeah, also get some other things done. Like uh, I would love to really love to get back to some drawing again. I really miss drawing so I hope that um, as soon as I'm recuperated a bit that I have some uh, um, yeah energy again in the mornings and for drawing bef before I go uh, to work. So um, yeah I hope that that helps and uh, eventually um, I would also like to work four days instead of five. I think that would be better for me than working 40 40 hours a week, it's, 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 it's quite a lot I find, especially if you have a, a, a job that doesn't really fit your, yeah, your abilities. And um, yeah, so I think uh, for the evening shifts and working four days to five could be really good for me. And in the meantime, I'm also, also looking for a different job, um, something that fits better with my strengths of my weaknesses because I feel that with this job uh, I've always said that I don't feel that my autism is a handicap when I was working on my drawings but it depends what in, in, in your environment or what kind of job you do and in this job I feel that my autism is nothing but a handicap the, the, the communication part of it the information processing the being on the timer non-stop um, yeah, I feel like I feel like uh, aut my autism is a handicap, and I should be working in an environment and in, in, a, in a specific kind of job where my autism is an, a strength, a, a strength and an asset instead of a handicap. And I think that's an important point for every autistic person, not just autistic people, but everybody in general, actually. Um, what else? Yeah, I've also been thinking about uh, because I just I just I just feel like on the inside I'm I'm still a kid and I feel like I have to live an an an, an adult life the life of an adult and and to me it really feels like um, my good my best is not is not good enough for for the life that 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 is required of me and. Um, it feels like running behind a driving bus and trying to catch up with that. I never, never try, never be able to catch up with the bus. And then uh, when the bus stops at a bus stop, you think, oh, I'm catching up, I'm catching up. And then right before you catch up with it, it drives away. And it feels like my whole life is like that, just trying to catch up, trying to catch up with that bus that's driving right in front of me. That's uh, actually how I can uh, describe the feeling. It's just never, never be able to, to just 
catch a breath, never be able to, to take a breath and to, to, to recuperate. And um, I think that's very healthy actually. So I'm, uh, yeah, I'm working hard trying to fix that. Um, well, this was it. Um, kind of a short video, but um, yeah. I also hope with my evening shifts I have more uh, energy and time in the mornings to my videos because by the time I come home from work it's dark and you need kind of good light to make good videos so uh, um, yeah it could, it could help a lot to, to get other things done including my videos before I go to work. That was it. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Subscribe to my YouTube channel to stay uh, updated about my um, uh, my latest videos um, and I, um, I wish you all uh, a great day. Bye!